Hi everyone, it's Simon Keeling here on Thursday the 26th of June. Thanks again for watching. Uh, goodness me, this is online late tonight. Uh, my apologies for that. One of those days, don't know where time's gone. Anyway, just a quickie for you. Just wanted to show you these charts. This is the uh, pressure from various different models for the next 10 days. And you see this pattern that's emerging here where we're seeing a building pressure into the early to middle stages of next week. Look, and then this fall off late on in the week into the weekend. Also, um, here's this weekend's rain look, but then we go largely draw a few showers coming through during next week, but then right at the end of the week look, into Friday and Saturday and Sunday, things turning more unsettled. Now you'll know um, that I was predicting that we'd see this better spell of weather here during the middle stages of next week, but I did expect it to last a little bit longer, at least to run into the latter stages of next weekend. But increasingly, this time period here is getting squeezed and I'm starting to wonder now whether a brief spell of fair weather will be a really brief spell. I spoke about four or five days worth but actually now starting to think, I wonder if it doesn't go more than about three or four. And it starts a bit earlier and finishes a bit earlier as well. The CFS MJO um, brings us into phase six here, look, on the 27th. So that's tomorrow, Friday. And this is the typical phase six for June from the MJO. It puts lower than normal heights towards the east and towards the west, higher than normal north, higher than normal south. So this is the effect of that low look. It eventually brings in a northerly flow. We find this ridge kind of hanging on up towards the uh, northwest, but we suffer with the showers uh, brought about by this trough. But eventually the high does build back in as a ridge coming through us. So that would be the ridge they're building during the middle part of next week, ahead of this feature, which I think really sets the scene as we enter into phase seven here, which is forecast to be around the 3rd of July to the 4th of July, so right at the back end of next week. And phase seven typically brings us these conditions with a trough off towards the west and uh, the trough extending into Ireland and the western parts of the UK, bringing showers and outbreaks of rain there. But you notice these higher than normal heights look trying to hold on across more eastern areas. So I think the idea that the models are showing at the moment of the uh, fairly deep low developing through the course of the week after next and trundling its way eastwards across northern parts of the country, bringing really deeply unsettled and disturbed weather is probably one that's going a little bit too far at the moment. I think the models are running away with the idea of those westerlies. I suspect it's more of a slow breakdown and the chipping away of these conditions from the west uh, late into uh, next weekend and into the following week. However, I'll tell you more about that tomorrow. But for now, thanks again for watching weatherweb.net and whatever you're doing. Have a great evening and uh, thanks again for watching and keep the sun shining. Bye for now.